So I'm going to make a call that some people may agree with, some people may disagree with. As always, this is not financial advice. There's no guarantees in crypto. But the more I look at the charts, the more I look at the data, the more it seems like Bitcoin is not going to fall back below this thirty-eight dollars to $39,000 range. Now, again, it's not financial advice. There's some data that is backing this up that I want to share with you guys. And what I really mean is that we don't have a weekly close below those levels. Now, many people are familiar with Dan Gambardello, and he does a great job with, with content, with charts. And there's something he's talked about a lot recently that I want people to be aware of. And what he's talking about is this bull market door. And what this is, is the range between our 618 and our 786 retracement from our bull market, bull market high to our bear market low. And what we're doing right now is we're actually testing this range and never before, never before have we broken through this range pre having, you can see we've tested it several times and just never, never really broken through until it's post having. And what I really think that this bull market door is, is it's alt season door. That's really when the charts begin to run up and to the right and don't really face a lot of retracements right now. I would say we're in the bull market cycle. We actually uh, confirmed that here back in December and what it was really is an overall change in sentiment sentiment in the overall market. So we're, we're at that point, the early bull markets aren't fun, but right now, if we smash through these levels, who knows how high prices could run? This is obviously huge for ADA. This is huge for alts. Now there is something that I want to refer back to. I've said this many times before this cycle that we're in right now is oddly reminiscent to what we experienced back in 2016. If you guys are, are familiar, this is what the charts looked like at that point. We had this period where we just started climbing, faced some consolidation and then climbed very, very heavily pre having. Now this one, we didn't get to that, that bull market door, that alt season door, but what I want to point out on here is that when we look at this weekly chart in terms of BTC, once we got going, there was something that never happened. We never fell back below, at least had a weekly close below this 20 week moving average. And I think that's very important. Now, if we fast forward to this current market cycle and we take a look at what's happening, we're well above all of our moving averages. We're well above this 20 week moving average. And the funny thing is right now, this 20 week moving average is at about 39 K. That's the reason why I say it doesn't look like we're going to retrace here. You have to weigh, you know, institutional money flowing in the buildup in sentiment, mass adoption, enterprise adoption, things like these are all playing an impact into what the charts are doing right now. And this is really leading to me to believe that we may have the most explosive bull market cycle ever, and we may get kind of an early alt season. Now, I, I know I did an ADA video a couple days ago talking about the possibility of an early alt season. And I don't think it happens pre having, but what I want to say is it would not surprise me if we got up to the top of this alt season door, right? Retraced, came back down to the 618 range. And then sometime within, you know, a, a month to a month and a half post having is really when we break through kind of an early trigger, if you will, and a more explosive trigger than what we've seen in, throughout history. All right. So that's why I'm thinking that we may not go back down to those levels. Now, could we go down there? Sure. Right. If we get some black swan events, we enter a recession, you know, things like that could push us to lower levels. But really, if we do go down, then it's really probably somewhere in that 38 to 32 K range. I don't think 15 K is coming. I don't think 10 K is coming. People that are talking about complete new cycle lows, I think are, are off their rocker. Okay. People can do what they want. It is what it is. Now, why this is important for ADA is when we do truly enter alt season, that's when ADA is going to perform its best. All right. That is when ADA tends to run the most explosively. All right. ADA is not a great bear market performer. It underperforms in bear markets, but what it does do is it overperforms in bull markets. When things really get running, ADA is one of the most explosive coins in crypto. And that's where things really, truly get exciting. And those times are, are closing in a lot quicker than I think people realize. I believe we're only about 60 days to the halving right now, 64 days. So be prepared. These exciting, explosive times in the market are, are on our doorstep right now. And I hope everybody's bags are packed. So I appreciate you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Show your support below. Let me know your thoughts. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.